hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video guys and on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to live stream on your youtube channel so i'm not going to show you guys every live streaming tool or every way to live stream on youtube channel but there are actually two different ways to live stream on youtube and there are two different types of live streaming now the first way to live stream on youtube channel is making use of the youtube application and then the second way is making use of a third party live streaming application that is actually done and then there are two different types of live streaming which is probably a live stream you are probably recording your face or a recording with your camera and then there is actually a live stream where you have to be recording your screen which is probably your phone or maybe your laptop so that particular type of live streaming is actually only enabled for some certain users and not available for every users so if you are a new youtuber you will not be able to live stream with the facebook app with the youtube application which is this particular one i'm going to show you guys today but do not worry i'm going to show you guys an alternative way to live stream on youtube so if you're trying to live stream But as a new YouTuber, I will not be able to live stream because I've not actually met the YouTube requirements. Now, if you click on learn more, you are going to see all of the YouTube requirements right there. It's going to display in front of you. Wait for it. So this is actually the YouTube requirement for live streaming on YouTube. First, you need to get 50 subscribers. And then second, you need to actually have no live streaming restriction. And then third, you need to have verified your channel. And then all you need to do is enable live streaming and you may need to wait 24 hours to be able to make use of live streaming. But this particular feature is not available for me because I have not actually reached 50 subscribers yet. So I need to actually wait till I get to 50 subscribers till I actually make use of that. So guys, um, I'm actually going to show you guys how to live stream on mobile, making use of a different YouTube account. So let's dive in. All right, guys, so this is my second device. And if you can notice, um, I have YouTube application open and I currently logged into a different channel, which is um, LifePad. And when I click on this area, you can notice that particular channel is having 11K subscriber, which for it is loading up. Now you can see 11K subscriber right there, which is very good. So to start our live stream, all we need to do is to click on this plus icon right there and we have to select go live. Now, once you choose go live, automatically it will start recording um, your camera. Now, let me raise my screen up. It's currently recording the front of my camera, which is this is my ceiling and that is my fan. So if you want to record the back of your camera, um, just tap on that particular option. This first option right there. Tap on that option to switch the camera. So when I tap on that option, it switches the camera back. But you might not notice it clearly, but if you are on your device, you can notice it easily. So... Um, you tap on it once more it will start recording the front camera that is how it does but then if you want to record a game you know games are actually recorded on the phone so um games are played on the particular phone so if that is what you want to record just click on this second icon right there this other icon not the camera icon this second icon that has a phone icon click on that and when you click on that it displays right there so once it displays your screen um, it's going to ask you to select a game to live stream. So I'm going to choose a game and then I'm going to search for a particular game called Loot Jewel. Now it has actually displayed the game right there. It's called Loot Jewel. So I just select the Loot Jewel and then um, you notice on the bottom section right there, you might have to click on this section to actually um, add even more settings. So when you click on the settings, you can notice it asks if the game is actually made for kids or not. So I already choose on default that is not made for kids. But if it's actually made for kids, go ahead and select that. And then after that, I also usually click on the advanced section. Under the advanced section, this is where you actually enable or disable the chat section. Probably if you either want people to read the chat or do not read the chat, this is where you actually enable it. So, and also the monetization, you can also enable the monetization by tapping this area. The monetization has been enabled. And if you do not want to display monetization here, just click on it and it's going to deselect. So now, after you select it, go back and then click on Next. You notice everything is set. Just click on Next and then it will um, start recording your live streaming. And then um, 
we haven't started right now guys um you actually need to upload a thumbnail so you have to click on this pencil icon right there and then upload a thumbnail but i do not have any thumbnail generated for me so i'm just going to upload any random picture i have on my phone um let me do this all right <laughs> okay um clicking on save and then there is actually two settings right there there is landscape that is if you are playing a game that is landscape and there is also portrait but since the game is portrait i'm going to choose portrait and then i'm going to click on next and you notice it displays all of this icon um you can read all of this information but i'm going to click on got it and then um i'm going to say start and then once it starts um going live you can notice there is even more information right there this first one is actually for the camera the camera is currently enabled you notice on the bottom section but if you want to disable the camera all you need to do is to press this first one that first camera icon tap on it and when you tap on that camera icon you notice right there it changes to logo and also if you do not want to record your mic just disable this mic right here but i think i'm okay with that and if you want to reduce the size of this stuff you can actually move this stuff around is actually your logo if you want to reduce the size of your logo all you need to do is to click on this gear icon right next to the um, recording section and then i usually drag it down to the bottom now you notice it now smaller so i think i'm okay with that um go back i think i'm okay with that and i'm going to click on back to navigate back and once you're ready to start live just click on live but i'm not ready to start live until the game has loaded so just click on the game to open the game and once the game loads up you can click on play or you can just click on go live to start live streaming the game so now when i click on go live now my channel is probably live right now so wait for it now i have just went live you notice it says your streaming has started and once i click on play the game will start playing and then i can enjoy the game with my fans claim reward i can enjoy the game with my fans and also i can just um do so many things like showing them around the game or so many things just carry my friends along all right um so guys uh this is actually all i want to show you and if you want to end the live stream at any time just click on this logo icon right there and it will display this information on top click on this s icon just on the top area right there once you click on it it displays an information and ask you are you sure you want to stop live streaming so you can now decide yes you want to stop or cancel but i'm going to say okay once i click on okay the live stream is going to stop and then it's going to end my live streaming and guys this is all i want to show you on today's video the live stream has ended i didn't go live i didn't do much thing and this is all i want to show you on today's video this is actually the statistics of your life every time you went live it always shows the statistics of your life so guys thank you for watching the video i hope it's helpful if it is much like subscribe to the channel guys i will see you on my next video please stay safe and peace